Okay, I put myself out here like I'm this really good putter, but I've been putting with uh, this putter for a couple of months now, and I, I reverted back to a more traditional style putter for a little while, and now I'm back to this uh, Peretti that my good friend Mark Valier is letting me borrow. And as you can see, I'm kind of shoving it down the line. I'm shoving, 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 and as you'll see in the next video, it's um, really um, it's it's a, due to a little bit of a of a flip in my left wrist. So this video is basically taking you through uh, the different sequences of how I decided that I'm going to go back to left hand low. After watching Jordan Spieth make everything on the planet for the last two, three years, maybe even four years, um, there's something to be said about patience and uh, drastic measures and even decelerating into the ball to make sure that that face stays square to your intended line. So as you can see, I'm constantly kind of shoving and trying to figure out how to uh, keep the, the face square and it actually comes from my left wrist having too much freedom. So as you'll see in the next video you'll see how I go left hand low. Well, a series of videos and how I decide to go to left hand low. Okay, so here is where you're gonna see the little flip with my left wrist so as I come through, you'll see just that little bit of kind of a up motion with regard to this left wrist. Whee! And then you'll see my head stays really my head stays really um, still. But you can tell just by my reaction right there that I'm just a little disgusted with the fact that I can't make these these putts. I really can't even get it in the center of the club face. So you'll see that that little that little flip there with my left wrist. Let me see if I can get it to. So it's right here. See how the wrist goes up on that line? And I want more down the line. I want the, the, the putter to stay lower to the ground longer through the stroke. And that's just me. I mean, you know, in golf, there's no right, there's no wrong. It's just what gets it in the hole. And to me, keeping the, the putter head lower to the ground I have a nice descending blow, but I don't keep that, I don't keep that angle and kind of keep it low to the ground. A nice Hogan-esque stroke is what I'm looking for. So next video you'll see uh, how I change to left hand low and how it starts to work and I start making all these putts and I actually make 12, yeah, 12 in a row. So. Left hand low is the way to go. After I pretty much realized, after I looked at the watched the videos and and was was looking at what my uh, really what my left wrist was doing, my left wrist was flipping. I wasn't I wasn't pressing um, like I am here one handed, uh, and I made all of these by the way. So you can tell I'm I'm kind of resetting my my setup position there and I just wanted to lock in you can tell that I, I pressed the upper part of the grip against my forearm a la Matt Kuchar but what I did was really concentrate on trying to really feel the club and the club head being really low to the ground you'll see here really low to the ground ball starts off very very nicely no skid no bump just an instant roll and you can just tell that 
my pendulum, the fulcrum is really my shoulder, really my scapula in the back, if you can if you can imagine that. So as I'm going through this particular drill, I'm pretty much figuring out that in order for me to lock in that left wrist very nicely and securely, I really am, am starting to get it in my head that I need to be left hand low. Now I've gone left hand low before in the past, like I said earlier. And just going with this particular putter head, and I didn't think it, it would work, but I've, I've watched enough of Jordan Spieth to know that it will work with his uh, Newport Scotty camera. And this is a, uh, a Peretti that's a, uh, you know, everybody tries to copy Ping, but it's a, you know, it's a uh, Ping answer, um, kind of a, a refined... Uh, ping answer model that uh, Peretti uh, developed and just just watching just watching this and watching my stroke it was you know very apparent to me that that this that this needed to happen sooner rather than later now I can just tell you right now that I have played since I've uploaded these videos and it is dramatic uh, how much more confidence I have how much better the ball rolls off the face and stays true on the line that I have picked now if I miss putts it may be because of speed or wrong path or wrong line or wrong point that I've picked maybe a bad read maybe bad speed but I tell you what, my stroke is killer. It is right at it. And you can see, whoop, let's go back. You can see on all four of these, I think I made all four of these, but you can just tell that I'm very comfortable and you can kind of tell that I actually get lower on the grip and lower on the grip trying to mimic that left hand low sequence. And then in the next video that you're gonna see that I, you know, basically I'm just rolling the rock as smooth as possible. And that's what you want. When you have smooth greens, especially this time of the year in Texas, uh, everything is fast, everything is slick. And you want to get a true, true roll on what is happening. So let me go ahead and, and draw some lines here real quick. You can just tell that right here, that this left hand stays pointed towards, flattened, and actually pushed towards the target so much better. In this first one, it's not as much, but you can tell, I don't really move here, that I get a little lower on the grip, and that the back of my left hand stays basically in this position more secure and longer. I mean, look at that. That is what you want. Right now, Dustin Johnson is putting very well, and he has a very nice left hand towards the hole, towards his, his intended line, and keeps the putter head very, very low uh, to the ground. So, you know, this is me after about, I don't know, probably 10, 15, 20 minutes of discovering that I myself as a professional I need to go left hand low and and probably going to start teaching this on a regular basis